Hello Libra, welcome to your weekly reading. So Libra, the messages that I put forth, they are general. So take what applies and leave the rest. Also, it is timeless. So whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages could resonate the most. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, as well as Jupiter. So make sure to check your other placements and let's tap in. Spirit, give me some energy for Libra. Messages for Libra. What's the energy? Messages for Libra. What is the energy? What would you like for Libra to know at this time? I have the Hermit. Oh, hey. This is the light side of the Hermit Virgo energy. Oh, and the Empress. Your energy as well as Taurus. The light side. Good job, Libra. So somebody definitely um, is operating from a very healthy place. I feel like you are manifesting like crazy, Libra. Um, you're a very powerful manifester because of where you are energetically. Let's go ahead and tap in. Spirit, tell me why is the hermit here for Libra? What's the message? Why is the Hermit here for Libra? What is the energy? Why is the Hermit here? Messages for Libra. I have the Four of Cups. Yeah, I feel like you're definitely in isolation. Um, you don't want to be bothered. You don't want to talk to anyone. I feel like you're keeping a lot of things hidden. You're keeping yourself hidden. For some of you too, I'm hearing moving, relocation. So this is something you could be thinking about. For some of you, you recently moved, relocated. I feel like you're keeping even like your place of residence hidden. I can't make this up. Four of Wands, like you don't want anyone to know where you live, where you stay. Give me an energy for the Four of Cups. So number four could be significant with the Four of Cups, Four of Wands, 44. Tell me more. For some of you too, I feel like you were invited to a wedding, but you don't want to attend. And I'm hearing a long time ago. I feel like this is somebody that um, you haven't dealt with for a while or you feel like you should have cut off a long time ago. Seven of Wands. It's just giving me a very restrictive energy. Like you just really want to be to yourself. Don't want to be bothered. Why is the Four of Cups here for Libra? What's the message? Why is the Four of Cups here for Libra? The High Priestess, but it flipped out in the reverse, Pisces energy. You know what? You don't trust somebody's intention. That's what it is. That's why you have your guard up. Give me another energy for the Seven of Wands. Now, for some of you, I'm hearing manifest. I feel like there's somebody that's promising a commitment saying like they're going to marry you. But again, you don't trust this person. Three of Cups. Something has to do with third party energy. Somebody having someone on the side. I feel like that's about to come out if it haven't already. Give me an energy for the Seven of Wands. Something also has to do with somebody being like extremely protective over a third party. Page of Swords. Even though it's in the upright, it's giving me that somebody's like a liar and very childish. Why is the Three of Cups here? Make believe like this is somebody that will tell you a story fast, false story. Ten of Swords. Yeah, I feel like you're learning about some type of betrayal here, and this happened multiple times. Give me an energy for the Three of Cups. For some of you, I'm hearing sabotage your wedding, a future tent. So for some of you. It's not going to resonate for everyone, but I feel like there's going to be a third party trying to sabotage your wedding, reception, ceremony. Give me an energy for the Three of Cups, or this could be you in this energy. Take it as it resonates. 
death, scorpionic energy. Yeah, something is over. Like there's a cycle, a painful cycle that is closing out for you, Libra. I feel like you learned your lesson. You learned all about this person and their lies. Yeah, look at this king of wands. So for some of you, um, you could be dealing with a fire sign or somebody that has a highly aspected, but it's just giving me again, third party energy. Now for some of you, there's a, a, a feminine who's cheating with a masculine. And I'm also getting something about two masculine energies as well. Give me an energy for the Page of Swords. Why is the Page of Swords here for Libra? The Six of Swords. Yeah, like you know all you need to know. It's time for you to move on, to, to love on yourself, to heal, to find real love. You're being guided away from this situation, Libra. Like you don't want to talk anymore. You have nothing to say. Give me an energy for the Ace of Cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here for Libra? What is the message? Why is the Ace of Cups here for Libra? What is the energy spirit? The King of Pentacles. Yeah, you're going to find your match. You're going to find your husband, your, your wife, your spouse. The right one. I'm hearing um, Ray Charles, you got the right one, baby. So yeah, you gonna find the right one. Give me an energy for the high priestess in the reverse. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, cause somebody's a liar. That's why you don't trust this person's intention. Somebody just makes something up again, make believe. Give me an energy for the high priestess in the reverse. Watch the high priestess in the reverse here. I have the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody was lying to you about a commitment. For some of you, again, marriage. Somebody's lying about committing to you, marrying you. They don't plan on giving you this offer. For some of you, somebody's lying about already being in, com being in a commitment, being married, or offering a commitment to somebody else. Give me an energy for the Knight of Swords. I feel like somebody's just a stalemate. Give me an energy for the Knight of Swords. Why is the Knight of Swords here for Libra? Queen of Swords. Like I say, for some of you, this is a feminine. This is a feminine that is in this energy. Tell me more about the Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands here? Now, for some of you, too... Um, I feel like this is happening like outside of you. You're just observing things play out. Give me an energy for the four of wands, but something definitely has to do with the wedding, a marriage, commitment. Tell me more about the four of wands. Why is the four of wands here for Libra? The nine of swords, somebody stressed out, they're worried, anxiety, can't sleep at night. Somebody could be fearful about going through with the commitment. Tell me more with the marriage. Why is the four of wands here? Somebody could also be concerned about living together. Give me an energy for the four of wands, the knight of pentacles. This person has been stressed about this for a long time. Like somebody's been worried. They haven't found any peace when it comes to this situation. I'm hearing Aaliyah, we need a resolution. Tell me more about the Nine of Swords, Page of Pentacles. Somebody's scared about starting over. Tell me more. For some of you, Queen of Swords, this could be somebody that has been divorced or Libra. You've been divorced and it's like, you know, now you're about to get into a new relationship, move in with somebody or get married. And it's like, you're scared about starting over because the past relationship did not work out. Things didn't go in your favor or this person's favor. Give me an energy for the nine of swords. Why is the nine of swords here for Libra? The king of cups. Somebody's wondering, like, will this person 
emotions like will their feelings grow for me like when are they gonna fall in love with me give me an energy for the page of pentacles why is the page of pentacles here page of wands yeah something's new or it's like Somebody doesn't have like intense feelings when it comes to the relationship, like deep emotional connection, attachment. No, that isn't there. I have the chariot, the sun, the nine of wands, Leo energy, cancer energy. So it's like somebody's guarded, somebody's blocking out their own emotional fulfillment. And for some of you, it's because like either you or this person is afraid to start over. Somebody's very guarded. Somebody could be very distant. So for some of you, like this is you questioning like how this person feels about you. Give me an energy for the sun. Why is the sun here for Libra? What is the message? The Six of Cups. Something in someone's fulfillment. <sighs> like you're meant to have a family together. Something's going to make you very happy. Four of Wands. Somebody's been calling this in. But somebody just needs to speak up. I'm hearing Tevin Campbell. Can we talk? Tell me more about the Nine of Wands. Why is the Nine of Wands here for Libra? What's the energy? Somebody, somebody can't make up their mind about what they want or who they want. Give me an energy for the Knight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here for Libra? What's the message? Why is the Knight of Pentacles here for Libra? What is the energy spirit? The King of Swords. I'm just getting my like distance. Somebody's been very distant. Tell me more. Somebody's been trying to control the situation. Somebody, you know what? Somebody's been like too much in their mind. Um, instead of following their heart, how they feel. I'm also getting somebody's been in their ego as well. The Eight of Swords. It's like somebody's been mentally stuck. Like they don't know what to do or leave or you don't know what to do. Why is the King of Swords here for Libra? What's the energy? Why is the King of Swords here for Libra? What is the message? Why is the King of Swords here? The Six of Pentacles. So... Somebody has to make a decision about who they give to. Now, listen, Libra, if this is you, you have the choice between two. Um, one of these people really don't give much of anything. It's one-sided. It's not balanced at all. If you're on the opposite end of this and somebody has a choice between you and another person, like whoever the other person is, they're the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. They really don't give much. They really don't bring much to the relationship. But somebody still has to choose and they're stuck. Give me an energy for the Eight of Swords. Why is the Eight of Swords here for Libra? What's the message? The Queen of Wands. Somebody's stuck on a third party. That's what it is. Something could have to do with, you know, someone's attractiveness. Like, in, in the physical. They, but they don't bring much else to the table. Give me an energy for the Six of Pentacles. 
strength, Leo energy. Like beauty, confidence, like that's all some that's all this person really brings to the table. Like the outer <sighs> appearance, like vanity. Somebody could be very attractive, have like very like strong features, but they don't do much else. I'm hearing like housewives. So for some of you, this is somebody that wants to be taken care of. Somebody could also be pregnant. There's a child here. The Empress, Knight of Wands, Page of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. But it's all about the money. That's it. This is somebody that's not going to like work hard. They want to be provided for. Somebody wants an easy life. And it's going to leave this person or leave you in the three of swords. Somebody's going to end up being heartbroken, hurting themselves, sacrificing two of cups, ten of cups. Because of what looks good. Now, for some of you, this has already happened. Let's pull some final messages. Spirit, tell me more about the hermit. Why is the hermit here for Libra? What's the energy? Why is the Hermit here for Libra? What's the energy spirit? The Knight of Wands. Nine of Cups. In the reverse. You know what? This person has become wiser. Somebody has been doing some reflecting. And they're realizing that passion isn't enough. It doesn't satisfy them. It's not what's going to bring them happiness. That's what somebody has realized. Or they will. Give me an energy for the Empress. Why is the Empress here for Libra? What's the message? Why is the Empress here for Libra? What's the energy spirit? The Ace of Swords. Somebody seeing the truth about you. You're the Empress. You're the abundant one. Mentally, emotionally, spiritually. You're who this person should have partnered with, four of wands. You're where the happiness, the bliss resides. For some of you, this is somebody that wants to start over. They're definitely in regret. Somebody's been taking time to really think things through. Like somebody is into their their light, their light side. Um, they are moving out of that shadow. They're no longer resistant to change, resistant to the truth. They're just they're recognizing, you know, what it really is. Give me an energy for the ace of swords. Why is the ace of swords here for Libra? What's the energy? Why is the ace of swords here for Libra? What's the energy spirit? Why is the Ace of Swords here? What's the message? The Knight Page of Cups and the Three of Wands. Somebody's moving away from an energy that's emotionally immature. Somebody is emotionally immature. Tell me more about this Page of Cups. The Hangman. Pisces energy. This person also knows they owe you an apology. For some of you, like I said, this person turned their back on you. Somebody walked away. They felt like, you know, something was just better. For some of you, something definitely has to do with the mother or someone's child. But this is somebody who manifested you. They asked for you and they chose wrong, but it was because they were blinded by the physical, by vanity, by lust. Give me a final message for the reading spirit. What's the energy? Somebody is also realizing the truth that it's time for them to move on. Give me a final message for Libra. What's the energy? <laughs> Confirmation. Come on. The chariot. It's time for them to move on. They see it. They know the truth about themselves, about their actions, the past, why they chose what they chose. Give me some more final messages, Spirit, for Libra. What's the energy? Somebody could definitely have cancer, highly aspected. Be here now. The present moment is the answer. In 
It's all we really have. The future is just a child of the present. Focus on the now. So yes, yeah, like whatever you are doing in the present moment is going to affect your future. And that's what somebody didn't realize. Somebody didn't look at the bigger picture, but now they see it. They get it. Bottom of the deck. God lives within me. Ask me. I have faith in what I cannot see. Somebody needed to trust the process. Somebody didn't have enough faith. They didn't believe. And that's why they ended up choosing wrong. Lack of clarity. So, this is your, somebody's name could be Amanda, Samantha, Ashley Brittany Taylor, Ravina. I'm also hearing something about Riviera. That could be significant, Riviera. I'm hearing drive. So something deals with where someone stays, like the, the street, the area, location. But stay true to thyself. The number nine is also significant. The ninth is significant. Something significant definitely about this month, September, as well as January. 15th, 16th, stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.